guys? Well, guess what? We're in the fourth week of Advent. Can you believe it? Christmas. It's around the corner. Only five more sleeps, and I'm so excited. I love Christmas. I love the lights, the decorations, the presents. The presents I really like. The food. But most of all, I love the fact that we get to celebrate the most famous birthday of all. And we're the ones who get the very best present because we get Jesus. Think about it. God, our Heavenly Father, he loved us so much and so badly wanted to have a relationship with us that he sent his only son here to provide for us a way to have a relationship with him. And we can have that relationship through our relationship with Jesus. I don't know about you, but I think that's pretty exciting. So, what do you think is happening with our friend Billy? And here's Billy. The days are getting closer. And Billy is still hoping for that bicycle. He's done all that he could do. Today, he was taking his dog for a walk and he decided to walk by the store where the bicycle was hanging in the window. Imagine his surprise when he got there and the bicycle was gone. He could have sat right down there on the sidewalk and cried. He was upset. Why didn't God listen? Didn't he know that Billy should have that bike? Slowly, he walked home with his dog trudging beside him. Prince, the dog, knew that Billy was upset, but he, of course he didn't know why. He just knew that he needed to make Billy happy again. When they got home, Prince ran around in circles around Billy and finally persuaded Billy to, go, Billy to go out in the backyard and play. As Billy was throwing the ball and playing with Prince, he realized something. His dog loved him no matter what. Billy needed to remember that God loved him as well. Maybe it wasn't the right time for him to get the bike, but God knew what the right time was. So right there in the backyard, Billy prayed and he told God that he wasn't upset anymore because he knew that God had the perfect plan. He told God that he knew that God loved him and that it would work out. Billy told God that he loved him as well and thanked him again for the gift of Jesus. So, what do you think? Do you think Billy's going to get that bike for Christmas? Well, stay tuned next week, and we're going to find out what he did get for Christmas, okay? Let's pray. Dear God, we're excited about Christmas and the gifts that we may get, but we know that the best gift was the gift of Jesus. We love you, God, and we love Jesus, and we thank you for loving us so much. And we pray this in your son's name. Amen. Now, guys, I have a little surprise for you. I have a guest visitor today, and I hope that you're going to be as excited to see her as I was. Floyd? <laughs> Hi, guys. Hi. Long time no see. Here I am with Karen. We're being good. We're social distancing. I have missed you guys so much. I'm hoping that if we're good and wear our masks and social distance and wash our hands, that sometime next year, hopefully before Christmas next year, <laughs> we can all get together again as a group and give each other a big hug. <laughs> Merry Christmas, guys! <laughs> Zooming back. Okay, that's it.